This is what an asteroid looks like through the most powerful optical telescope on Earth. So how do you begin to study an object you can hardly see? Well, one way is to study these. Tiny fragments of asteroids that have fallen to Earth and broken apart, called meteorites. This is the oldest thing you can hold in your hand, really a piece of history, back to the time even before the Earth was formed, in even way, way before uh, we were ever formed. Almost everything we know about what asteroids are actually made of comes from studying these kind of fragments. Each one has its own history of the solar system. They're like a puzzle that we're trying to understand. In fact, we think some asteroids are made of iron, or at least they were so large that when they formed, they heated and melted, they could get all the iron to their core, just like the Earth has an iron core. And when we take a big iron meteorite like this, and slice it open. The quality of the metal is really quite amazing. It's a very pure metal. Nickel iron, uh, some of the oldest metal in the solar system, in fact, more than four and a half billion years old. So out there in space, there are gigantic boulders ranging in size from 900 kilometers to just a few meters and made of primordial metal and dust. But the more scientists have examined the remains of asteroids, the stranger they get. It's probably a complete zoo. And we find the meteorites have a huge variety of types and compositions. And it's telling us that the asteroids must have a wide variety of compositions uh, as well. There is one type in particular that has opened a door on the strange and unfamiliar world that asteroids inhabit out there in the coldness of space. We think that most asteroids are probably like this, very stony-like, the kind of things we find on Earth, but they have a completely different chemistry than Earth rocks. They're put together like little bits of rocks, all reheated and remelted and, and glued together. And it tells us that the asteroid belt is a place of, of a, an incredible impact history. Asteroids colliding into each other, breaking apart, reforming. And so when we see these meteorite samples, it's telling us about that amazing collision history in the asteroid belt.